So the reason that my family and I decided to um, participate in the Dominion Green Power Program is because we're really sustainably um, driven. So for example, we have a solar electric array um, on the top of our house, on the roof, and a solar thermal array um, on the side, um, largely to kind of lead by example. Um, but that only offsets a certain percentage of our power and really couldn't afford to do uh, the other uh, panels to get a full array to offset 100%. So in order to do that 100% uh, green power contribution, we needed to solicit the help of the Dominion Green Power Program. Um, and so that's why we, we decided to sign up. Um, I actually run an environmental consulting company. And so uh, in previous, I, I worked for 16 years for the Department of Environmental Quality. So certainly uh, my commitment to the environment runs deep. We have uh, children, we have dogs, uh, my husband and I both work full time, and we don't really have the time to invest in coming up with creative ways to be more sustainable. Of course, we do things like uh, green cleaning products and, um, and you know, don't run the water and um, programmable thermostats and those types of things. But we could participate in green power um, because the investment monthly is minimal compared to our expenses and far worth it. I would liken it to um, the cost of me going to lunch one time a month um, and that offsets the rest of our power. So it's extremely easy and extremely affordable, which is great. Well, it's definitely one of the reasons we just, it was a no brainer for us to sign up because you know we wanted to show our support for this program at a certain level because we'd like to, we would hope that our neighbors in our community would also want to sign up for this program. By showing support for green power in general, it's gonna show how much we, we as consumers care about that. Um, and hopefully over time, um, more investments will be made in renewable energy technologies, whether it's wind power or solar power or what have you. So when we first opened in October 2011, we were setting up our electricity through Dominion's uh, website and seemed like a pretty simple option to sign up for their green power program, which essentially took 100% of our electricity and sourced that from renewable sources. So um, we signed up um, day one as soon as we opened and have been 100% subscriber to the green power program ever since. So participating in this program for us is a great way to share with people what one of our core values is all about, which is trying to be as sustainable as possible in our manufacturing. Um, we are able to do it through tours when people come visit the brewery, through social media, and uh, ult ultimately it's a great way for us to show people what Hardywood is all about. Uh, Spark, the School of Performing Arts in the Richmond community. Uh, we're 33 years old. Um, we actually provide, uh, we empower and encourage young people to reach their full potential through the performing arts. So we use singing, acting, and dancing as a tool uh, to teach life skills, to creativity, confidence, and responsibility. I was inspired to work with the Union Market based on the sustainability practices, from working with small vendors to working with local gardens to provide fresh produce in the area. I definitely feel like the Dominion Green Power Initiative has been beneficial to Union Market in the fact that it's, it's reinforced um, a more top-to-bottom approach of how we can help the community. It's one of those responsibilities of SPARK is to teach life skills and responsibility to our students. And the Dominion Green Power Program is a great way to do that. Um, you know, uh, we're basically teaching future generations about sustainability. In addition to um, employing the Dominion Green Power Program, we um, have a lot of sustainable practices around the brewery. Uh, one, we work closely with a company called Citywood that um, does something they call tree cycling, which is using trees that have fallen naturally in storms to create furniture. And uh, this table was made by them. Uh, all of our tap handles are made by City Wood. Um, so that's one way. We also um, sent all of our spent grain to a local farmer to use for uh, pig and cattle and goat feed. One thing we found is that today's consumer seems to value sustainability and I think as a company if you can for very little cost and very easily engage in a program that um, ultimately will make your company more valuable to a consumer um, I think it's a win-win for everybody. 
I'm very proud to work for an environmentally responsible business. And I think everybody should sign up for this program.